What's up everyone, Sake down here, welcome back to another hockey card video. Today we have this hockey mystery box from Walmart. Now these are new to my location, but after looking them up, I think they were released in early 2020. But here in Canada, near Ottawa, they just were brought out. They were never there before, at least to my knowledge. So that's really cool. It includes one mystery item and four factory sealed packs. Now, I'm kind of, in a way, getting tired of these, so I'm hoping I get something good. It does say the mystery cards could be an Upper Deck Series 1 for 15-16, which I highly doubt it. Or Black Diamond, which, again, I highly doubt it. It's kind of on the lighter side, and I can hear something with the top loader bouncing around. So, probably not one of these as a bonus pack, but we will see. Let's open this up here and see what we get. I'm actually, I usually leave this for the end, but I'm going to start with it. Top rookies for Clayton Keller. Now, you guys know I have a small PC of Clayton Keller, and I already have this card. It's not really the greatest of card, and this one's typical to get in these boxes, especially not only just top rookies, but I'm talking about Clayton Keller. I've seen multiple unboxing videos where this card is the bonus card. So, I mean, I will take it because I like Clayton Keller, but this is a double for me. Now for the packs, we have a CHL 17-18, that's cool, a 15-16 Series 2, Series 1 17-18, and 16-17 Series 1. Um, I'm going to start with the CHL because I've never opened anything from them. Let's see what we have here. Right up first, Promising Futures for Alec Thompson, Tom, Thomas. We have a Star Rookies for Nick Wong. That's cool. Dylan Wells. Tyler Radish. Dmitry Solov. S Soklov. Mason Shaw. And Tony Mordand. Morgan Geeky. I actually do like him. So that one can go over here. Braden Gorda. Yvonne Koserva. I'm not going to try it. Liam Murphy. And Garrett McFadden. Not too bad. I do like the cards. The design looks really cool. I just don't know most of the players other than Morgan Geeky. So I'm going to start with 1617 next. We have Jamie Ben. Phil Kessel, I'm not 100% sure if I have this one, so if I don't, that one's going to my PC. Martin Hazel. Ebony Gusnikot. Alan Quinn, Young Guns. I think I already have that one, but I'll put it there. Francois Boschman, Darnell Nurse, and Ben Bishop. He is doing amazing in the playoffs. So that is really cool. So I'll put that over here because I do have a small PC for him. Next, I will do 1718 Upper Deck, which is the year I actually started, and I bought a ton of these. Blaster boxes, individual retail packs, hobby packs, and I have most of all of the base in my opinion. Victor Arvidsson, Frederick, Frederick Anderson, Hampus Lindrum, Andrew Shaw, Mike Hoffman, Matthew Kachuk, Patrick Maroon, which I collect, but I already have this card, and Marcus Sorsen for the Young Guns. Not too bad, two Young Guns. And now we're going to be doing the 15-16 Series 2, which I probably won't get anything good because I usually don't that year. Troy Bowerman. Ryan Johansson. Oh, I see something there. TJ Yoshi. Boston Bruins rookies for Junis Kempenson. Sidney Crosby, I know I don't have this card. This was before I started really collecting. Thomas Flushman. 
Matt Molson, and Alexander Barkov, which I do have a small PC for. So I did get one Cindy Crosby card. That's really cool, in my opinion, because I do like to collect a lot of his. But this box here was, I think, $16 at Walmart. A little bit more than I usually uh, go for whenever I take a risk. But this here, in my opinion, was not $16 worth. The CHL cards, I don't really collect them, to be honest with you. The bonus card is already a double, but regardless, it was not of much value anyway. So this one's going to go on a mystery eBay pack for myself. I did get a couple cards here for players that I PC. Just base, Ben Bishop, Phil Kessel, and Morgan Geeky, because that's the first card I received of his. I did put um, Alexander Barkov over here, and also Sidney Crosby as well. I do have a small PC for Sidney Crosby. And the only hits, real hits, are the Boston Bruins rookie for Jonas Kepitan. Young Guns, Marcus Sorensen, and Quinn Allen, which I might think is a double. I'm not 100% sure if I have this one, but regardless, is it $16 worth that was inside this box? I do not think so whatsoever, but comment down below if you guys think I should try one or more of these boxes. I'm kind of almost over them. I prefer getting my cards off of eBay, whether that being a mystery pack for really cheap. I get great stuff out of it, so... Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to leave this here. Please take care. Peace.